This is the new Carrera Vulcan. And quite frankly, if you're on a very tight budget, or if you're looking at purchasing your very first mountain bike, they are worst ways to spend 400 pounds. It features a 2.9 Shimano Altus drivetrain. and hydraulic disc brakes. Oh, and a bell. And some wheels. Six weeks ago, I taught my son how to ride a bike. And we are now taking this training to the next chapter. And as I am about to upgrade his bike, I thought I would share with you my five tips to upgrade a budget mountain bike. Tip number one, don't spend a fortune on your upgrades. Your budget mountain bike has been built to a very tight budget, it means that it is compromised in many different ways. And the reality is that you are probably going to fall in love with the sport. And in fact, if you are watching this video right now, you probably have already caught the mountain biking bug as you're trying to find ways to extract all the performance you can from your existing bike. So. You know, take it from somebody who has spent lots of money on completely unnecessary upgrades over the year. Your money is much better spent towards your next mountain bike than in buying a carbon seat post or a carbon handlebar for this one. Tip number two, only buy parts that you can transfer to your next mountain bike. Your next bike will be, of course, a great step up from this one. So spend your money wisely. Why upgrade wheels, which are very likely to come up with quick release, uh, when your next bike will use probably a boost setup with ball through axle, for example. So only invest in parts that really add something to this bike and that you can transfer to your next bike and that will still be a good performance upgrade on your next bike. And um, top tip, don't throw away the parts that you are replacing because when you're going to sell this bike you'll be able to put them back on tip number three focus on the grip points what i mean by the grip points are the pedals the tires and uh, the grips for your hands A good pair of flat pedals will last you an absolute lifetime because they can be serviced, they can be rebuilt quite cheaply uh, and a pair of good pedals will give you stability, will give you more grip, more efficiency and it will give you all the confidence you need to start elevating your game a little bit and making some serious progress. If you are new to the sport and you don't know where to start, I recommend a pair of DMR V12. You just cannot go wrong with those. The tires that come from an off the peg um, budget mountain bike are not the best. In fact, quite frankly, they're awful. Um, they're usually uh, a cut down uh, version of uh, the original tires. The car case is extremely uh, rigid. The rubber is awful, it's very slippery. This is a well-known area where manufacturers completely cut cost. So, you know, just get rid of them. Uh, my go-to brand is Maxxis. I had those tires fitted on my G170. I wanted to upgrade them to something a little bit different for the winter last year. And I kept those tires and passed them onto this bike and they are perfectly suited for what we're going to be using this bike for. Tip number four invest in a good pair of mountain biking shoes like those ones again if you don't know where to start you cannot go wrong with a pair of 510s absolutely fantastic mountain biking shoes the uh, stealth rubber sole is going to give you maximum grip it's rigid it's stacky it's going to give you all the confidence that you need to be able to start pushing yourself a little bit more on the trails tip number five invest in yourself if you think of it do you know many sports that you would take up with no coaching at all? Well, mountain biking is the same. A good coach will teach you about body position, about grip points, about uh, cornering techniques, 
and it will make you so much more confident on your bike and you will be surprised how much faster you are riding after just one session with a great coach. Uh, I can recommend two particularly good schools that I have attended that are really, really great. Dirt School in Scotland, uh, near Glentress. Um, absolutely fantastic tuition, great coaches, really enabled me to uh, gain a lot of confidence and have achieved so much in uh, the space of uh, one day. Uh, and uh, 417 Bike Park um, in Gloucestershire. Uh, absolutely brilliant coach, brilliant facilities, and a very safe environment for you to be uh, really developing your skills. I'll put their details below. Et voilà, after just a couple of hours of tinkering in the garden, our upgraded budget mountain bike is ready to take my son to the next stage of his journey. If you are interested, check out the description below to see the detail of all the upgrades. Well, I hope you found uh, those five tips helpful at all. If you're an experienced rider and you think that I have forgotten something obvious, please share your experience in the comment section below. Uh, I'm sure everybody will find that very helpful. As always, thank you for watching. If you have not done so already, please consider subscribing and see you next time.